E and D here. We have more spoilers for Double Masters, and the lens cycle for this particular set have been spoiled, and we're going to get the filter lens from Shadow Moor. I know you were expecting, I was expecting the fetch lens, the anime fetch lens, but for Double Masters, we're going to get the filter lens. Booster box of Double Masters, it's around $250-$300. Booster pack VIP edition, it's around $100 plus. And we get the filter lens from Shadow Moor, not the fetch lens. I'm going to talk about that later on in this video. First card, Wooden Bastion. Filters, one green and one white. Current price is around $15 to $20, so I'm expecting that this lens will go down to half of that between $8 and $10. Firelit ticket filters one red and one green, same price fifteen to twenty dollars. Graving currents the most the least expensive out of the five filter lens, reprinted in future sight, reprinted in iconic masters. Current price is around six dollars, so I'm expecting that this will go down to three to four dollars. Mystic gate filters one white and one blue, same current price around fifteen to twenty dollars. And the most expensive out of the five filter lens from Shadow Moor, Sunken Runes, filters one blue and one black, current price around $30, so I'm expecting that this will go down to between $15 to $20 with this particular reprint. Now, these are the five filter lens, the cycle lens for Double Masters. As I was already explaining in the beginning of this video, everyone was expecting fetch lens in this particular set. But I think and I believe there is a very specific reason why fetch lands are not in this set. Even though we're still getting booster boxes of double masters at around 250 to $300, and as I said, VIP edition is $100 plus. So I was really expecting to have fetch lands in this set, considering that how much expensive are those particular packs. As I said, I think there is a very, very good reason why we didn't see fetch lens in this particular set and the reason is that fetch lens are so expensive that wizard of the coast want to use them for future special products we are seeing very very new products vip edition collector booster boxes secret layers we are seeing these particular specialized products and i believe that wizard of the coast want to use the fetch lens because they are so expensive because they are so demanded to promote those particular special products at a very expensive price. As I said, we had already the Secret Lair Ultimate Edition, $300. And I'm sure that in the future, we're going to have more specialized expensive products, and these will contain the fetch lens. Had having fetch lens in a product released in May slash June, with all the problems that that particular product had, I didn't think, even though that I hoped, that fetch lens will feature in Double Master. I think fetch lens will feature in the future, sure about it, but in a specialized, very expensive product. You can always leave me a comment below. What do you think about this cycle, the cycle lens in Double Master, and what do you think about the reprint of fetch lens in future products for Magic the Gathering? As always, follow the arrow, subscribe to my channel for more and more interesting videos about Magic the Gathering and the collectible world.